Hello everyone, did you know that your smartphones have certain apps that were installed quite recently, but you don't even know about it? They were installed silently, without your consent or knowledge, and they're running on every smartphone right now. This is especially true for phones with Google services installed. For example, it could be a Google account on YouTube, or it could be a Google Play Store account, or it could be your browser. Again, it doesn't matter which one, it could be Google Chrome, Opera, Mozilla, Firefox, Yandex, and so on. Or there are simply Google services, which include email, Google Maps, the regular Google browser, Google Drive, and so on. Basically, if you use anything on your smartphone, you can be sure that one of these apps has been installed that can track and identify your photos in the gallery. This is a new system service that was automatically downloaded and installed on your smartphone. Let me show you how to find it, because not everyone can find it. But if you want to stop this inexplicable tracking and scanning of your device and files, and sending them to unknown servers, then, of course, watch this video to the end. Be sure to give the video a like, subscribe to the channel, and share it with your friends. So, to find it, firstly, you can basically use the standard settings. You can go to the regular apps, all apps, click the three dots here, show all apps, and try searching. But if you can't find it that way, I'll show you a universal method now, because you might not find it there, but with the second method I'll show you now, almost anyone can find it. To do this, you need to go to the Google Play Market, where you download games and apps. Then find your account or avatar in the top right. Click it. Scroll down and look for the question mark at the very end. This is help, feedback. Click here. You'll then be redirected to this menu. It may differ for some users, so I immediately recommend using the help search. Click on the help search. And here, type delete. I didn't write it completely, and it tells me how to delete an app from an Android device. Click here. Now we'll be redirected to this menu. Here, we need the blue line, go to the app settings. If you're using a dark theme, you might not be able to get here. In that case, you'll need to temporarily switch to a light theme, and then you'll be able to get here without errors. All your apps, including system ones, will load here. Here, click on the three dots at the bottom and click show system processes. The only downside is that there's no search. It's impossible to find something there, or even enter a word, and have it appear. By the way, let me know in the comments who's used this method, or the second method. It does have a search function. And so, it didn't take long to find this app, called Android System Safety Core. You can usually tell by the icon. So, rest assured, it was installed automatically, without your knowledge, from the Google Play Store, which we just accessed. This is Google's new security system that identifies your photos and continuously scans them from your gallery. This is necessary so that if you have any photos that are not suitable for viewing by a certain age group, that is, if you have photos on your phone rated 18 plus, 